Hello, and welcome to Grug Gaming. Welcome back to our Let's Play of The Legend of Zelda. Uh, we just finished up the, uh, third dungeon. Uh, and we're now headed off to the fourth. But first, we got a little bit of work we need to do, um, over on the, uh, overworld. Uh, we're gonna go grab a heart container, uh, and then we're gonna head to the next dungeon. So, avoid touching the statues that cause pain. We'll head on over here. And we're gonna start by heading back to our starting spot. Actually, what we have to do is we have to go uh, across the entire map, almost. Well, almost, we're almost all the way from one end to the other. Uh, and we're going to head over to kind of the area where the first bomb shop was that we went to. And that is where we are going to get ourselves an extra heart container. Uh, and we're going to be able to do this now because we have the raft that we didn't have before. So let's keep going here. You know, we might buy some bombs while we're at it. Just because we are down to a single bomb. And I want to make sure that we have some. It's never good to run out of bombs. Ah! Stupid things. The worst. Uh, let's see. So we'll head on over here. Hey, look! Some bombs! Now we don't need to go to the bomb shop. Well, that's easy enough. Solved our own problem, we did. Alright, we're gonna go straight up here. Oh, look, a little time freeze arena. There's what we're looking for. So here we have, because we have the raft, can we get. No, we need the ladder to get that one. Um, this one we can't get to. This is not the one we need. We need the raft heart. Uh, we can't go that way. Really? Really? There we go. That's what we're looking for. Here we go. Use the raft. Travel up here. There we go. Now, never take the potion. Always take the heart container. Why would you... I mean, come on. Be real. Alright. Alright. New heart container in hand. We'll head on over. We're gonna go quite a few screens now. We'll have ample opportunity to get killed on the overworld. And we just gotta keep going, going, going. Ow, get shot in the back by a boulder. Get killed by tektites. Just embarrassing. Embarrassing. Now uh, we'll cross over the desert. The scary, scary desert. Keep going. Ow. Ow. You know, there are times. I feel like I'm being targeted. Uh, let's see. Past dungeon one. While we're here. Oh, we didn't get a heart. I was thinking we'd get a heart out of that. Uh, past this little section. We did get a heart there, though. Uh, we need to head over a bit. Oh, a fairy. Oh, we missed a fairy. That's okay. It happens. It happens. And from here, we're going to raft up. And the next dungeon. All right. Uh, let's go left first. Oh. Yep, got a key. Okay. 
So we got a key there. We're still sitting on three keys. Seems odd. Oh, what's this? What are these jelly belly looking things here? Oh, that's unfortunate. They turn into bats. Go right. Oh, it's dark. All right, we got the compass. Uh, if I use this, light up the room. It does. Okay. Look at that. I remembered stuff. It's good that, that light stays permanent. I was afraid that it would light up the room and then it would go dark again. I was gonna be very sad if that was the case. Oh, this bouncy little guy here. Please do not bother Rug on his grand adventures. Uh, no prizes in this room, but we got a compass. Uh, up, I guess we go. Oh, they respawn. That's the best. Uh, we got a key. Let's kill everybody and see if we get a, a kill everybody prize. Nope. No prize for killing everybody. It's okay. Another dark room. Let's just go ahead and get a old uh, view on this. A little bit of a... Spot here. Again, we just need to make sure there's no prize for killing all the monsters is what we're checking for. Ah. Nope. No kill em all prize. And imagine coming here and not having the candle. That would be the worst. Ooh, we almost have full hearts. We're getting there. Getting there. Let's see here. Look at that effective use of the flame. I'm the best. He able to come across here? No. Okay. Come on. Open the door, Grug. Okay, we do have a kill everybody door, it looks like. Boomerang is just not working today. Apparently it's taking the day off from uh, doing its job. That's fine. Oh lord, these things are the worst today. There we go. Alright. Do we get a prize here? It's a prize room. Oh, it's those things. I think those things eat our shield. And it's got these stupid light ball things that are the worst. Go away. our way slowly along here and just be careful. Okay. No room prize? Oh, that feels like... Oh, wait. Aha! There's the ladder. Alright, so the step ladder allows us to cross those little one-tile waterways. And that means we can not only advance in this dungeon across that little moat that we came across, but uh, out in the world we'll be able to get that heart container uh, that we couldn't get to a little bit ago. I don't know what's up here though. Oh, we can just walk across these areas now. Makes these rooms a lot easier. Well, let's see here. Oh, there's the map. Alright, well, let's illuminate. 
Oh, well that's that's a tricksy thing to do, Room. That's just mean. That's a waste of a key. Alright. But see how now we can just walk one space out into the water. It does make us have to be a little careful in those rooms, but that's okay. Uh, let's see. Should be able to go back and get that map here in a moment. Now we've already done a kill all on this room, so we know there's no prize for it, so no reason to spend a lot of time there. Uh, these guys, we'll have to kill all them in a minute, but first let's go get that map. Alright, so... Over, up and over, up and over... We're here, down and right. Okay, we've searched all the... We're, we've been in all the rooms. We haven't missed any uh, rooms getting through the dungeon. That's good. That is a good. I find it acceptable. Oh, they just... They get that one square off. And then they just mess up your whole attempt to hit them. There we go. There we go. That one's gonna hit us. It's okay. It's okay. Grug's got this. Uh, right now, we're just checking if there's a key or a kill-all prize that happens. Nope. Oh. Now, I happen to know, because I saw a picture of this dungeon, that there is a secret right here. Yes. That is the whole secret. Uh, I think that room you can go out any of the holes. Um, you can maybe avoid a, a fight or two. Oh. Walk into the waterfall. You know, if I can save a key by using a bomb, I'm going to do that. Because I think you can blow up here, if I remember right, from what I saw. Yes. Save ourselves a key. Oh, look, another key there. That's awesome. Let our flame die out so we can safely get across the water. Kill off all these keys. That's what they're called. I call them bats a lot because I'm just too lazy to remember the right word, but that's what they're called. Uh, lots of oh no. Well, I made a big boo boo. Alright, there we go. Not so bad. Who is the boss of this dungeon, I wonder? Well, I hear him. He's making noises. I don't remember the boss of this dungeon. Come on. Alright. Nope. Nope. There we go. Alright, what do we got? Here we go. Uh, okay, Dragon Head. Can I shoot him with arrows? No, can't shoot him with arrows. Okay. Uh, can I bomb his face? Nope, can't bomb his face. So, we just gotta old-timey this one. The magic shield is not protecting us, it appears. There's one head down. Oh! And it floats around. Oh my goodness. Okay. Come on. Come on. We're so... Oh. We almost lost that one. But we got our heart container. We are out of bombs. That's upsetting that we're out of bombs. But that's okay. Okay. 
Let's see here. Where are we headed next? Alright. I'm gonna kill this stupid thing. As soon as it stops moving, it's mine. It's mine! Stop moving! Stop moving! Stop it! Stop! You. Mm. Alright, so. Next up. We have got a couple things we're gonna do. We're gonna grab another heart container. Let's see, we're 15 minutes in. Do we have time to do all this? I think we do. Let's see. Let's see. We are going to do a couple things. Let's stop stalling. Let's go get going. Uh, first, we got a heart container we got to go grab. We already know where it's at. We saw it earlier. Got a little bit of movement we need to do here. All right, which is... Whoop! Head on over. Uh, oh, again, we're just headed towards that edge of the map. I totally missed that coin. There we go. Let's see. Get our health back up. Lose our health right away. You know how it is. Um, let's see here. Oh, all these things from the ground the worst the worst look I know they spawn in front of me when I walk I should know by now to stop and let them spawn but it's not the way I roll apparently not the way at all okay Go. But this oh, this guy here sells bombs. We're gonna grab some bombs actually. While we're here. I think we'll uh, let's fill up all the way. And we're at 18 minutes already? Hmm. Let's see what happens. All right, so get out of the way. Heart container. Health. Up we go. Free bombs, even though we just bought a bunch. It's okay. It's the way it goes every single time. Uh, let's see here. Long, get along, little doggy. Walk right into the bad guys. Walk right into more bad guys. You know how it is. All right, we are on our way. Uh, our goal here is, I'm trying to get to, I believe it is called the power bracelet. Uh, if I remember correctly, is the name of the item. And looking over, I have just had that confirmed. go uh, in here no straight Whoa! Oh, I hate these things get away from me all right so now we should be able to get across this with our ladder oh yeah uh, and from here we're gonna go down oh those fluttery things are awful They're everywhere they know how awful they are. All right. Okay, first, oh, we got a whole bunch of garbage here. All right, what's in this shop? First things first, what are we selling here? Bombs, the arrow, no, we're good, thank you. 
Uh, we'll just head on over. Alright, from here, we are going to activate, I think, this guy. Yes! The power bracelet! Woo! Um, so that gives us the power bracelet. Uh, let's see here. Now we can move susp special boulders in the overworld, but that's fine. Um, next up... Uh, let's see, what are we doing here? Alright, we are headed over to get the magic sword. The final sword of our playthrough of our game, before we just kind of buzz through dungeons, I think. So, uh, we are going to need to do a couple little adventures. Uh, which is... Let me go down here. All these centaurs shooting laser beams. Let me go up here. Oh, this was it. Hold on. Alright, hold on. Oh, okay, okay. Be be careful, Grug. Aha! Yes! We got the magic sword. There we go. We now have the most powerful sword in the game. Now, we will head over, and we're not going to go up here, we're actually going to use the power brace that we just got to open up access, I thought it was one of these, how oh, handy. There we go. Access here. Take any road you want. Well, which one do we want? Um, I think we want this one. I think we want this one. All right. Yes, this is it, I think. Maybe. This is it. I think this is the repeating maze. Or if we do this four times... Should we get some magic notes? There we go. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Game, you know me so well. Alright folks, well with that, we are ready to head into uh, the next dungeon. We'll be picking that up on the next episode of Game with Grug. Until then, I want to say thanks for watching. Please tell your friends. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, we hope to see you soon.